When you're building projects with shelves like we have in this step back cupboard, you can make them a whole lot more functional by making the shelves adjustable. That way you can move the shelves up or down so that you can keep things that are tall or short or in between in your cabinet without having to worry about how they're gonna fit. Just move the shelves to where you need them and you're good to go. When you're creating adjustable shelves, you need to drill a series of holes for small pins that the shelves sit on. By moving the pin from hole to hole, that's how you adjust them. Now those holes need to be spaced evenly and consistently at each of the four locations so that your shelf will sit flat and it won't wobble. That could be a challenge to do with just a hand drill. But with a shelf pin jig, it makes it easy because the jig has a series of holes at consistent spacing so you can get the holes exactly where you need them. A great tip when you're using a shelf pin jig is to create a spacer. I cut this one to length to match where I want to locate the jig in the cabinet. Just set the spacer in place in the cabinet. And then you can set the jig right on top. Now I know it's located at the height where I want it, and the jig has this fence that hugs up against the edge of the cabinet, so every time I move the jig, I know that it will be at the exact same height. With that set, I'm ready to drill holes. After you drill the first hole, you can insert this locating pin that drops right into the hole. Then you don't even need the spacer to hold the jig in place, and you can drill the rest of your holes. You can see that every time I drill, this stop collar stops the hole at the correct depth. And the result is nice shelf pin holes, a little sanding, they'll be set to go. Now I can take the spacer and move it to the next location and drop the jig in place. That way I know that these holes and these holes will all be aligned. Drop in the locating pin once again, and just keep on drilling. Now, all I'll have to do is a little bit of sanding, and I'll have shelf pin holes. They'll give me perfect shelves that are easy to adjust and that sit level without wobbling.